What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Sound Entertainment. Once again, back in Wreckfest here today for a pretty awesome track that I've actually been putting off taking to for a little while. Uh, and it's it's actually a lot of fun. So now that we're done with the gauntlet uh, that we did in Wreckfest uh, last week, which, by the way, if you missed that one, be sure to check it out because it's two hours of nothing but insanity. But now that we're done with that, we're going to take to some different tracks to go a little bit outside the box here for a little while just to... Uh, take a step back and regroup a little bit, if you will. Uh, and this is a pretty fun track. I've run it once uh, as a bit of a test, and it was a long time ago, so I'm hoping it still works. Uh, we're going to jump into this one right now with the NASCAR Legends, as you can see, out in full force, and uh, hoping we have a good race here. So let's go for it underway, and everybody's coming towards Yep, they're still doing this. Everybody's coming towards the inside of the track for whatever reason. This always happens, and there's a pileup of massive proportions right there, and I am, am I stuck on the wall here? we got to get this thing back in the right direction. Already off to a less than ideal start here. So you got cars going every which direction. Can I gap a hole here? No, I can't. Oh, and that's hard in the wall. Hard into that little fence, the busted up fences, which I'm sure we'll make plenty of friends with as this race goes on, and I'm going to get tagged again, and I'm going up a rock. I am going rock climbing, and that is not the kind of thing you want to do with this type of vehicle. And there goes somebody down the, the ravine, if you will. And, man, we just, I got a little scared there at the end. Watch out for the rocks. You got to be real careful here. Don't want to fall off or anything. There's a lot of split paths and a lot of deep, deep ways you can fall to your death. And we want to try to avoid all of those as we come out of here uh, down into sort of the main straight, I guess you will. Uh, in the top five now, fighting our way back up here. We got Fireball Roberts right here. We're going to land on him. Oh, watch out, Fireball. There he goes. He's gone and off the track. He flew. And this is like the carousel section on the track. It kind of reminds me of the carousel because it's deceptively tight once you get out here. You got to let off it. We've had a bad crash up here. It looks like Kowicki. Kowicki. Oh, I can't turn. Yep, no, there was not much I could do about that one. That car was bottoming out up the way up the hill. And we went head on a t-bone into that seven car and then it's not over yet we're getting hit a couple more times from behind getting knocked around up in the air stuck on the side come back down here and we've got some more cars catching us back up so that's a lap right there this is going to come across the lap line here and uh, we have uh, finished one lap at uh, oh god yep that's what i'm scared of and there i believe goes a wheel and if not then there they go for sure right there and we're dead and that's what you got to watch out for as we land in a pile of a couple other carcasses. Man, that, uh, it'll catch you looking the opposite way. You look the wrong way for five seconds and you're done. So there you go. Tough break right there. Eagle's Nest had a tough one off the start. Finished 19th. Bummer. Everybody else is a lap down except for the few leaders here. And Harry Gant takes the win. So there you go. All right, let's go ahead. Let's restart this one up and do it again. All right, race two is underway here at Eagle's Nest. And can we get a little bit cleaner start this time? Oh, I'm taking the Snickers car for a ride. Here we go. And I'm getting stuffed from behind. Getting ass backed over here. Getting sideswiped by a couple of the cars. But I think we made it through that all right here. Now can I get over the, uh, the little bridge without too much drama? And look at that. We're out in second already. But we got to try and survive still as well. Long ways to go. Uh, just because we're out ooh, in front doesn't mean that this thing is all over with quite yet. So Davey Allison out to an early lead here. I wonder what car he's driving. It's kind of hard for me to tell from all the way back here, but he's definitely going at a pretty good pace. So let's see. Oh, is he going to watch out? He, oh, he just crashed off the side of the mop and the mop, the mop and then uh, the map rather. And uh, he crashes out and then another car takes his place up here. The 10 car at Cal Petty. Not well, sure why he's in the 10 car, but that's just how they like to roll here, and up the hill we go. Coming to our first lap completed there. We got guys underneath the map causing ruckus. We got a couple of go. Oh, we got the 10 car spun out from the lead, and that puts us in the lead, but I'm going to spin it out too here if I'm not careful. Watch out. All right, we got one stuck underneath the map. That's tragic. I can't look at him too long, though, because we got to mind ourselves down here and try to get this win if we can help it without having too much of a problem, and we're... Hitting a few things, having a few terrain issues, but other than that, I think we're all right. Looking behind us, I don't see any competition anywhere near us. We got a couple of them laying dead in the street out here. The 43 car, got the 90 car over there. I'm here. I just heard a horrific accident take place back there somewhere. The 97's laying dead up against the wall here. Through the carousel, if you will. This thing's going to get tight on the exit, but we're back through here. and We've got 
Somebody stuck on the hill. We've got a couple of guys getting hit up at the top of the hill. Uh-oh, we got to watch out for the top of this hill here. Watch out. Three car, bad spot to pull across the track, and that's why. And that'll take him out of the race. Oh, and I dig hard into the, the, <laughs> the ground there as we're going to come to the final lap here. We might get ourselves a win knocked out of the way early here at the Eagle's Nest as I squeak through a couple of cars here, get past the rocks. Man, that's cutting it close on some of those. And we're going to go ahead. I'm seeing a lot of banners from this that old uh, destruction game, so this must be another one of those tracks that's like converted from an older game. So if you recognize this track, you better let me know down in the comments because uh, this one might be a little bit before my time. So be sure to let me know that down in the comments below as we dig in. Don't go off the track. Oh, -hoo -hoo. look how close that was right there, man. That could have been bad. We got Neil Bonnet up here running that Coors number nine car. Looks like he'll... Oh, he got it grabbed by the floor, and we take him out of the race right there with a side swipe through. We're going to come through the final jump across the corner, clear a couple of cars, and we are going to cross that invisible finish line and take the victory here at the Eagle's Nest. So there you go. Got it knocked out of the way pretty easily right there. And uh, had a good time anyway with that. The, the, the AI has a little bit of a struggle with this map. I assume most of them are falling off of, of uh, mountains and falling into ravines and whatnot like we, would, like we did. Uh, so let's see how that goes for us here again. I'm going to run one more standard race, and then maybe we'll throw in some, uh, some mods just to spice things up. What do you say? But let's, uh, let's do this race again. All right, so we got a victory in the bag here, and we're off again, and I'm getting, I'm getting hooked already up in the air. We're going, and I'm spinning out. We're going around here. You got to try to survive that opening. Oh, watch out. Fireball Roberts is already out of the race, and we took him down. That is not what you want to see here. Yeah, there it is. There's the banners I'm seeing right here. I don't know what game. I can't read that. Whatever that says, but whatever banner that game is for, I've seen that in a couple of the very track pack maps. So, uh, it's very interesting what game it is. Cause it's a little bit before my time there. But uh, I've seen, I got a couple of those before on other tracks, especially Chalk Canyon, which I assume is probably from the same game based on their design. They look pretty similar. Uh, let's see, can we uh, take the low side here and try to get through? We're in the top five. But even though we had a bit of a sketchy start, we're uh, right up here as so we got Rusty right behind me and uh, kind of tripping out there in the distance. I don't know, sometimes the graphics get a little bit weird in this game where <laughs> it'll make you feel like you're having a bad trip and things will start repeating themselves, and that's a crash into the wall, losing control. And I got to watch out how I turn around here because I do not want to get creamed like some of these AI do, and I've got a bad feeling back there. I just crashed in the same thing twice and I lost the wheel. I just crashed right into the same spot I did the first time. No, so now one of you might as well clear me out. Go ahead. Take me. Take me. You won't. You, can I even drive this thing? No. The one wheel life being gone. Really not helping me. Well, that's pretty tragic. Uh, we're getting some speed at least going, but I don't know how good the turnability is going to be. Uh, I guess I'm just going to wing it here. What can it hurt? Maybe something bad will happen, happen to everybody else. But uh, that's kind of asking for a lot here. Oh, digging in. Brutal. Somebody's going to come kill me. Oh, God. Oh, wow. You want to talk about <laughs> threading the needle right there, getting a haircut. Oh, my goodness. I We were, like, parked in the... If I could back it up a little bit, one of these guys might actually hit me. But I can't appear to do that, so we're just going to hit the reset. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, this thing is not wanting to go. This thing is not wanting to go. We're going to get hit right here by Kevin Harvick, and Kevin Harvick's in a bad way himself, as you can see. Oh, there we go. Get a couple of them to hit me. Oh, the seven car digs in. Hate to see it. Oh, we got one flipper. Was that the 28 that was flipping back there? I saw somebody flipping up there on the ridge. So, yeah, my car is just doing donuts at this point. It's just doing circulars. Uh, wait a minute here. Oh, big T-bone right there, and that's going to put me on the lid. That gives me a little bit more visibility. Come on. Who's going to do it? Who's going to come finish me off? Who's going to come put me down like a dog with many diseases? And here comes the 97 he missed, but the, the car behind him got me. I couldn't even see who that was. Whoever it was, though, absolutely destroyed us, and we thanked them for it, for doing us a nice duty right there. So that'll do it for, I guess, our... Our second attempt at a regular race. We did get the victory, though. So uh, what do you say we go throw on something like the pinball mod and come back and do it again?
All right, we are back here at the Eagles Nest here with the NASCAR Legends and the Pinball Mod enabled this time around. So this start's going to get even more insane. I can pretty much guarantee it. Let's just hope for the best. And oh my God, we got the worst. That is just disgusting what I just saw. What a despicable act that has just taken place in front of all of our eyes. That was one of the best coming togethers I think we've ever seen. We come out of this whole deal in second, and I, is that our clone up here? Do we got a clone? Yes, we do. The Red Baron versus the Red Baron over here. So we got to fight our own clone for the win here. Our car is mangled. It's amazing that this thing is actually driving pretty good right now, considering the beating that it just took. I mean, it, this thing just got abused a minute ago. All right, we got to be careful right here. Watch out, watch out. Oh, man, he, he took down a piece of defense there. It looked like he was going to go for it all. But our clone, he hung with it. Let's see, can he... Oh, I'm going a little bit of loose on the outside of that corner there. But we get to it here, and we're kind of getting whooped right now. This is... Uh-oh, this is going to be a bit of a minefield to get through, and our clone gets destroyed, and a couple other cars doing the process. And it looks like these guys are just having problems getting through, and I'm having a problem. I just eat a rock. These guys are having problems just getting through the starting area. So, tough luck for them. We, however, are making it through here. Not terribly, except for I'm going to knock the 42 out of the way. There you go. You said to free yourself. No? All right. He's going to go be stuck somewhere else. Oh, we got the 22 car up here. And the 22 car just killed itself. 22 car just, just drove backwards off the cliff. We got Cole Trickle back there stuck in the dirt. And I'd say we've got this one. Unless something really drastic happens, we've got this one pretty much in the bag, I would say. So just got to kind of mind... Don't do anything stupid. Don't don't throw the ro the race away on our own. Just just race and, and don't let people backing up in the racing line affect you. As we nearly had a close call with the wall right there, and that wall is a little sketchy. And then that's also very sketchy. That landing. Luckily, we come back on the wheels. Who is this right here? We got the five. Man, I can't even tell what number car that is. Look how destroyed that is. We got Morgan Shepard over here in the seven. Is using up all my space. Yeah, we, we got a live one over here somewhere as I nearly just avoided destruction in the six car. I don't know what happened to him, but let's come see. That was nearly tragic. If the six car finally comes to rest under the shade of a rock, well, that'll be a nice place to hang out for a little while because he'll probably be stuck there for the rest of his life. I see the 22 has driven out of the pit of misery that it driven itself into earlier, so that's nice. It's always nice when you get... Oh, wait, it's telling, why is it telling me I'm going the wrong way? Oh, Jeff Gordon, what are you doing? Well, we just killed Jeff Gordon. It's a damn shame. We lost the good one, but sometimes you just got to take that death. We know. We know all too well. Sometimes you just got to take that death. And uh, Jeff Gordon took that death on this day at the Eagle's Nest. All right. Coming out of the final-ish corner. Watch out. Don't want to hit people stuck here in the middle of the road. And I think that'll pretty much do it for the pinball mod. Because we've got this one in the bag here across the line, and we get another win at the Eagle's Nest. So, this is a pretty fun one, but uh, what if we tried just a regular car set? We'll, we'll put the NASCAR Legends to the side. Let's just go use the stock game car set. That might be work, might work a little bit better for this map. All right, we are back here at the Eagle's Landing for what should hopefully be a little bit better a race, but I guess we'll see here as we're in our sort of Avenger style. I, I don't even know what this vehicle is called in this game, but we've got it and we're ready to go. I've been desensitized to the normal cars, I guess, because of how often we use the NASCAR Legends, but we're underway here. Turned off pinball for the time being as well. We'll probably throw it back on here before this thing is over with, but much better through the start of this, although it's still chaotic as can be. Don't knock me off the side. Oh my word, this is going to be interesting. All right, so... With the removal of the NASCAR Legends, I also lost the NASCAR Legends name, so now we just got random gamer tags and whatnot I have to go off of. But we're up into the top five, which is a good sign, right? That's a good thing. Oh, we got a big crash taking place over here. We got a CRX-looking car that just got put in the spin cycle. And they re look like they recovered from it all right, but we got a nearly, ooh, barely missed one right there, and I'm going to get hit again. That's up to second. All right, not bad for an opening lap here as we come out of the carousel. And up the hill we go as we are chasing down uh, JoJo. 
I'm gonna come get you, Jojo VDK, but let me not crash first before I do that. All right. Let's just floor it on the outside here as one lap is down. Just gonna floor it over the ravine thingy on the outside now, and this is a race. I tell you what, this is a close race within a second here. Oh, we got a couple. We got we got a couple of a uh, bit of company back here. Watch out for the minefield of cars. It's probably going to be laid out now after a lap has been completed. I hear somebody making contact back there. Somebody didn't get through there all as clean as they probably could have. All right, let's take it easy through the carousel now. Nice and chill. Everything's good. Coming up the hill. We got a slow one going up the hill. We got one JoJo still a little bit behind us here, but he's losing ground overall. Let's go ahead and have a nice clean transition there and head to the final lap. And I want to go the opposite way of this slow car just so that it can't affect me. Oh my gosh, what just happened? The track came out and bit me. The track came out and got me right there. That was lucky that we didn't get shoved down to the ravine. I know that was unlucky still, but it was luckily unlucky. And I just got passed for the lead right now and that is not good. That really hurt us right there. Oh man, I thought this might be a one and done, but look at the lead we just gave up. Oh, is he gonna hit somebody that was parked there? Oh, he came close. He came real close. I think he ran over some debris of somebody that was stuck there. And he's got a massive lead. Oh, Jojo, you better come back. Jojo, I need a miracle here. I need something bad to happen to Jojo. The game, the track, turned into a Terminator itself and it came and got me. Can one of these lap cars create a problem? They don't. And I think that is probably going to do it. I think we're going to see JoJo wins the race just about any second here. He's just out of reach. And he beats us to the line. Well, that was a pretty close race, all things considered. Got a little bit of a bad break there, but we're not ones. You know, second place is the first loser, and, and, and we can't settle for that. We got to do it again. All right, attempt number two is off and underway. Can we get another clean start? Yeah, a little bit dirtier of a start than last time. Kind of got shoved out of the way there. But I'm going to go to the outside and hope for the best here. It's going to get a little clogged up, it looks like. We're just going to shove our way through. Just going to keep on moving. And I get shoved into a rock head on. And that is trouble. Not going to be able to go anywhere with that one. So I'm going to have to back it up. Lose a ton of time. Cars hurt. Definitely got some problems with that right front. And uh, our left front, I guess, more looks even more disastrous than the right one does. So... Uh oh, watch out, watch out. Yeah, bad place to park your car there, buddy. Real bad spot to take a breather. Would you look at that JoJo, that piece of crap, is sitting out there in front again. I can't believe it. Oh, Luch Man. Oh, well, bye bye. Bye bye. Ta ta. See you later, you poor soul. That cannot be very fun to fly out the top of there. We got one with this roof caved in over here ahead of us. We got a couple of cars behind us giving us a little bit of something to think about. Man, this thing's a little bit more jumpy than it was last race, and we're out of control. Spinning out. Got it back. But we are in a bad way. Okay. Thank you for that, you big jerks. That was unnecessary. You know, I'm going to come up here. I like taking this high road. Go figure. Why is it telling me I'm going the wrong way when I'm definitely not going the wrong way? All right, thank you. I feel like you get more momentum off the top line, but... Oh, somebody's going for a big flip up here in front of us. I'm getting takedown assists on cars I'm not even close to. But we're in the top five. So if something goes wrong for the four cars ahead of us, we might have something shaping up. Just maybe. Just maybe. Here we got one ahead of us. We got Sword of Grim. Can I get to him? And take him out of this race and just destroy everything about him. Probably not, but we're within 10 seconds of JoJo, right? So that's got to be a good thing. This thing is bouncing up a storm, and it's digging in, and once again, we're out of control here. Come on, power forward. Let's go. Sort of grim. Going to be right in my way. He's going to go the other way, though. He's got a bent-up wheel. He's got all kinds of problems. We got all kinds of problems. Take that high road. Get that thing a turn. I know we're not going the wrong way, so you might as well just get rid of that right now. All right, we're within seven seconds of first place. I see second place right here ahead of me. The worst first place. Oh, I'm going to drive underneath second place. Oh, there's a lot of dead people in this race. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. To first we go. To first we go. Oh, that's what I love to see. 
The AI got into a bunch of trouble right there, and that's gonna put your boy in the lead. Sometimes you just gotta take that death, and they took it. And we're gonna take the win. If I can hold on here, I've got a five second gap and grow in on the car behind me. Finally, we get through this section decently, and that's gonna be a victory collected at the Eagle's Nest. Well, there you have it. That's how it's meant to be done right there. That was a good race. That, I can't believe we drove underneath second place as he was crashing. That was awesome. So there you go. We got ourselves another win. And I feel like since we busted it out once already today, probably do it one last time here. Let's go ahead, enable the pinball mod, and come back here with the regular cars and close this thing out. Let's do it. All right, we're back here at the Eagle's Nest with the pinball mod <laughs> enabled. I'm sure this is going to be great to look at. So feast your eyes upon the madness. Wow, it was actually fairly tame. I may have spoke to a little bit too soon there. Oh, we got one coming across to get us here. So not quite as wild as the NASCAR Legends, but still pretty crazy. And we're still getting knocked around over here, by the way. Let's see. If we Can we get through the beginning part of the track? That would be nice. And we eventually do. So, as I was saying, not quite as insane as the NASCAR Legends. Bad spot to be. And you're going to ride your roof for a little bit. And you're going to go fly. Oh, nailed again. Ouch. Looked like bad times we had right there. So, uh, for the third time now, not as crazy as the NASCAR Legends went on the pinball mod here. But still pretty, pretty wild to say the least. So... We're up into the top five already with this, so we're not doing terrible. We're only seven and a half seconds back from the lead, so we've got some time to work with here. We've got a couple of wrecks, it looks like. Might give us some free spot. There's one down to third we go. We got one crashing right up ahead of us over nothing. Didn't even hit anything, and it still ate the wall. And that puts us on a podium finish right now if things were to end right now. But, of course, we've got a little ways to go as we finish our first lap. Across the ravine we go. Through the rocks. Oh, scraped a little bit of one of the rocks right there. But we're still going. I got an El Camino up here in front of me. Then we got another one up there in front of him. Something. Something or other. I can't see what kind of car that is up there, but we got a couple of oh big collision right there. Big collision. And that is gonna take a CRX out of the mix. And we got one almost driving off the map up here in front of us, and that is the leader. That's KWK box. Is that box? My name is Box. Is that Boxy? Oh, he's dead. That had to hurt. That I, there's. I am seeing no movement out of there. I'm not seeing any life. That car. Whoever was in that car is most certainly dead. I mean, you have to. You have to be dead. Basically, after that, you know what he did, ladies and gentlemen. He took that death. Just like I'm probably about to take this death right here because this is going to be a tight squeeze, and I don't know how we made that work, but we did. Okay, can we get through here? It would be rather neat if I could get this finished off right here with a win as we are on the final lap now. Just got to avoid any kind of insanity that might take place. We got some lap cars causing mischief. But I think we might be all right as I'm going to have one cut across me. Bad, bad time for that to happen. Real bad to all oh, man. Could you imagine? Oh, that's what I was worried about. I was just about to say, could you imagine if I got nailed right here and then the guys next to me did? And how are we still in the lead after all that as well? Oh, we got El Camino doing a donut right there. What is going on at the Eagle's Nest? Everybody's lost their marbles. We better cross the finish line before we do too. And I get hit from somebody. I didn't even see where he was. But we are going to survive, ladies and gentlemen, to live another day. We cross the finish line. And that is going to do it for the Eagle's Nest. A wild one. At the Eagles Nest, a couple of different races. I want to say that the regular race cars gave us a little bit better racing there. So sometimes you'll have that in Wreckfest, sometimes with some of these tracks. So had a good one here today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you have not already. As always, leave me a comment down below and let me know what else you want to see here in Wreckfest or in any other game for that matter, because uh, we're always looking at new stuff out here. And That'll pretty much do it, everybody. So thank you again for watching. And with that, I will see you all in the next one. Peace!